What is up everybody? Welcome to another episode, episode 50. An episode I've been waiting for because we're visiting Alibaba's headquarters in Huangzhou. Hope you enjoy this episode. What's up everybody? Welcome to another vlog. Welcome to another date. So I took a little break yesterday. I actually didn't go out with the group. I stayed in my room, kind of, you know, just went, ate lunch, ate dinner on my own. Not really vlogging either. Had a lot of work to do. Had to knock it out. Actually, the day I ended up staying in ended up being a super fun day for the group. Oh well, I had a lot of work to do. Had a lot of work to finish. Today, we are going to Alibaba, one of their headquarters here in Huangzhou. But for now, I'm gonna go to the supermarket, get some breakfast, get ready, and let's get out of here. I'm not waiting. No, maybe, no, 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 no. Whole bunch of no. Let's see if there's another place to eat. Good morning. Good morning, guys. So you guys know how I'm an AMG fan. Check it out. AMG. Got an AMG. Let's go. Finally got a f book bag. Hanzu. This whole area composed of about 60 buildings called Dreamtown and it's an innov innovation park for businesses, startups, all supported by the government. This space right here, it's a hot day. Enjoying, trying to learn as much as I can. Pretty nice. Pretty hot. Got some work to finish. Gonna take a shower and get out of here. We are all ready to go. Bag one, bag two. Let's get out of here. We just made it to Alibaba B to B headquarters. So initially they told us the bus will not go in and literally just now they let us know because we're a VIP group They're letting the bus go to this private entrance right here That's the only way we do it. You know how it is Let's go Okay, look where we're at. We're at Alibaba Currently we're at the B to B headquarters Oh, oh, oh look we found we found Jack Ma. We found Jack Ma. Let's oh. check it off <laughs> Yo, where we going, bro? Alibaba. Alibaba. It's absolutely amazing to know that they're B2B portion of Alibaba only started in the year 2000. It's been 17 years and look what, the, what they've accomplished. They've become one of the biggest, biggest online retailers. The company is built in Jack Ma's home, his apartment, which is in the west part of Hangzhou city. Just there, 18 people together with Jack Ma built this company, 1999. This is the first campus of Alibaba. And before that, Alibaba just worked in the apartment and some office building. And from Jack Ma's house, you can see here is Jack Ma's house. 
Gemma is the first partner. And we have five swimmers across the river and pass one by one, totally 102 people. Pass the, this thing to here. And then we move our family to here. So the idea for Alibaba from the first day is that we want to make it easy to do business anywhere. We want to live for 102 years. Anyone know the story? That's why I'm here, okay? So, I just introduced that 1999. It, at that year, Alibaba started in Gemma's apartment. So if we survive for one year, that will be a new century. And for the new century, we want to live for the whole century because we want to build a 100 year brand. And if we can struggle for one year more, that will become a totally new century. So 102 years will be the shortest way to build a company last for three centuries. So here is showing from 1999 to 2014, what is the big things happened to Alibaba company. This is the year we are funding. And in 2000, Alibaba get the first investment from the shop bank, Mr. Shun, okay, a Japanese investor. So in 2003, Taobao was built. And also, at that year, a special thing happened in China. It's called the SARS, a terrible disease. And also, some of Alibaba guys, because we moved to Guangzhou, and which is the disease area, and come back and get a cold. So the whole city is so nervous that Alibaba company was forced to go back. Everyone go back, cannot go out for two weeks. But the whole company survived from this event. So from 2003, every 10th of May, is that day we, the, the people was get a cold. Okay, so it is the Ali day. It is to thank the employee and the families of Alibaba employee. In 2004, Ali Pay, and in 2008, Timor, coming from Taobao. It is for the B2P, B2C, and Taobao is specialized in C2C. One of the big things is 2014, I already joined the company. I joined here for three and a half years. About three years ago, we do the IPO in New York stock market, which is also till now is the biggest IPO in the world. Here is one stop, one spot we cannot cannot escape. So this is a sculpture from the idea of a Mongolian. Because for the Mongolian guys, they are very strong and powerful. Uh, this sculpture is means power. And also, we believe that one guy here to look after the campus, so everything will become stable and peace. Human status in the campus is naked. They never wear any clothes. The idea is on purpose. It's on purpose because we trust that the people who work in Alibaba must be transparent. Alibaba, bruh. For the working time, we want people to be happy. So that's why you can see we have the Starbucks, we have the bank, we have the shop, we have the supermarket, we have the bookstore, we have the fitness room. And here, these two floors is the canteen. Can you imagine that is the most popular spot in China? And in this campus, we have around 8,000 people working here. And for the whole Alibaba group today, we have totally 60,000 people around the world. Alibaba's motto for their employees is work happy, live seriously. I haven't had any coffee since getting here, so I'm about to go to Starbucks real quick, right here on Alibaba B2B campus. Apparently, this is the number one Starbucks. They sell about 1,300 cups of coffee a day. Number one Starbucks in China. Alibaba experience was really nice. Got to learn more about the company, met a project manager, and that's about it. On this journey to 30, we gonna go places. We gonna go to Alibaba, we gonna go to China. We gonna go all around the world before I'm 30. Not to make money, but to have an impact. You guys watching this journey, you're watching it because you feel good about yourself and you make others feel good about themselves. We are here to spread positivity. You've got to take advantage of opportunities that come in front of you without actually missing them. Yo! How was that? Up, How was Alibaba? We secured the bag. We secured the bag. Oh. We slept secured, secured one of our bags. We <laughs> yeah. got another bag. Secured the bag alert. <laughs>
Watch your banana. Oh, thank you. Second person to check in. Look at myself after this three hour bus ride. We are finally back to Shanghai. Just for a day though. And then we're off to Beijing. I'm super excited for Beijing because it's the Beijing. Hey, Habibi, when are we going, Habibis? Yalla. Habibis. Let's go. Habibis, man. Habibis. Come on. 901. It's a piece of trash. <laughs> and what's so special? That's a sweet, bro. Are you serious? For real. Oh, nah. Yo, you had 901 last time? No. 1101. Or 1001. Ah, oh, s. 1011. I got, I got a sweet. It's a 901 game. We got the sweet baby. Wow, look at this view. Got a whole 180 view of the city, and it is beautiful. Much nicer. Anyways, I'm gonna get ready, and we're gonna go over to dinner spot. Looking to have some nice Mediterranean dinner. See you guys. All right, everybody. Got ready real quick. And we are about to go have some food. Some good Mediterranean food, hopefully. Done my five yawn tip. Go take us. All right, we need a taxi that'll fit five people. Okay, we're about to go have some Arabic food in China because we're Some tired. Arabic food. Bro! Hey, let's take bikes. No, we can't. Yo! We were standing right here and the taxi decided to take the two, two Chinese people and not the foreigners. Yo! Yo! <laughs> what is going on? So what just happened is, the taxi just left us. He wouldn't let five people in and we cannot find another taxi that will stop for us. It's been like 10 minutes. We're taking the alternate route. Bike. All right, we finally unlocked the bikes. Look who showed up again. Wait, wait. The girl. Ah, this is a video, right? This is a video. So it's, it's a video. <laughs> Everybody say hi to my new friend, Shinzu. So much hot. Well, good luck on your journey. Thanks. Bye. Thank you guys for watching that video. How'd you like it? If you did, like this video, subscribe, you know, like my page, whatever it is, show some love. This is Journey 30. I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. Out of the 50 episodes, if you made it to this point, I want you to leave a comment below. Which one was your favorite episode? If you don't have a favorite, just let me know how I can do it any better. All right? See you guys in the next one. Peace.